Last thing I'm like um, excited to talk about, though the journey is super raw. Uh, it's not refined. Our, our thinking on this isn't isn't that refined. But um, this record doesn't represent just another release, another live project, another. Uh, for us um, in this season, for me, it represents a new wineskin, like a new way that we're trying to um, uh, produce and release worship. Um, I've I've loved all the, all the different ways and models that we've done it up until this point, but there's something in my spirit that just says there's more. There's more to this, and and there's another level, and, and there's a way to protect uh, the anointing. There's there's a way to record and capture and write and produce worship that's just as worshipful, that's just as anointed, that's just as much of a fragrance to the heart of the Father as is the songs themselves. At least that's that's our hope. And um, and um, it's, it's a cry in our hearts in this season. I, I've been challenged to know what, to, to be like, what do I believe about worship and the making of, of worship music? What, what, what do I believe should be its distinctives? You know, I know the processes. I, I know all the different ways that we've done it before, but, but if we really want to see um, the kind of level of anointing, um, the, 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 the breakthrough, um, you know, in the spirit that these projects were intended to carry, I, all I know as I've learned this is that the details matter. All the details matter. The administration matters. The, the contracts matter. How the points get distributed matters. A God pays attention to all uh, of these things. And either you're pleased or, or, or not pleased um, by the way that, that we handle and how we honor each other in these conversations. How songs get written matter to the heart of God. Not just the, 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 end, the end game. And, and so we've tried to do this in such a way, everything's been an experiment, but we've tried to honor the Lord, to reset some things in the earth that have been, that have been, that's caused, caused brokenness, honestly. Bad contracts and different things, just going, how do we reset this? How do we let honor, how do we let kingdom generosity reset these things um, that have caused wounding in many musicians and in many producers and in many people that have made some of the most beautiful projects out there, but have ultimately left either hurt or or broken or or uh, divided, honestly. Um, and so it, it was. There's so much warfare when you set out to make a project. You realize how much warfare there is over worship music. And so this has been contested. We'd have to fight for this. We've had to fight for this. But at the end of the day, we're like, okay, we want to release something in family. We want to release something that honors um, and is done in radical generosity to all the people um, that, that helped make this. And we want this to be an offering to the Lord, not just the CD itself, not just the, the songs, but the whole process. And um, and uh, as as we get more clarity, we'll, we'll divulge more into that. But, but um, I feel like it was a it was a it was a beautiful first step in that direction. <laughs>